Welcome back to the SNES library. I am the curator of someone front mission. We played some... We didn't play well. But we still one handedly. Like, the game... has become a bit easy. And I, I really think part of the reason is that the enemies now have supply trucks, so... when they are damaged, they stop fighting us. And, like, they will try to go through the trap, like, even if their legs are broken, and they can't really escape us, they will try to go back, and then they're just sitting there. <laughs> you know? I don't know. Anyway. I won't ask you where you've been. The mission takes precedence right now. You're to eliminate the guards at Mail River, the former border. Once you have established a clear route, the regular army will proceed through to the nearby city and liberate it. Huh. So we are stuck doing the regular army's dirty work again. Listen, there are plenty of people that I could replace you with. I have no problem sentencing you to life in prison for insubordination, Keith. Ah. Do I make myself clear? Now get out to the battlefield. Oh, we got a screen again. Two boss units doesn't have to mean much, though. What is that thing? Yeah. Those numbers don't really mean much, though, do they? Anyway, also, like, I realize now what happened with uh, Mori last time. Like, she told Keith and JJ about this thing, and they investigated, and she got like, Hey, they are here, go fight them! Like, I thought she was warning us of the enemy. That's where the confusion was. Like, I have a problem. With like faction names, you know, I, I had to play Xenoblade Three for well over one hundred hours before I really got a grab on which side is KVS and which side is Agnes. Like I, I, I'm bad at that. I'm really bad at that. <laughs> okay. Anyway, let's go. Here. Oh, it's night time. Oh, so you like. Paul Necky. Stay alert and focused. Right, if we can penetrate this area, the OCU will have the the, the, the upper hand. What? Are the OCU we or the enemy now? I don't know. I, I would assume we, but I thought the enemy was the OCU. I don't know. <laughs> if that happens, it will definitely boost the troops' morale. That's why the OCU must break through here at any cost. I guess it's us. It also appears to be Vance's equipped with hover units. Don't stop in the middle of the river. You'll be chased down in an instant. I have to bring... Why is it with always like having to leave one person behind? It's still gonna be Yank. I think she's still the highest level. I hate this. Also because I can't see like the character's levels here. But also, like, the level, like, I mean, how much do the levels really mean? Like, a level gives you, like, oh, you get plus 15 in your weapon of choice. Like, you get way more just, just playing. Oh, wow, what are you? That's a commander. There's a switch scale, too. Hey, yeah, yeah. This thing looks nasty. Like, 360 HP is a lot. Move 20? Yo. So I guess that's like have a leg so that they can like probably float across the, the river. You can only go one in. Oh wow, wow. Can we have 20 range legs? Holy shit. Yeah, if I want to. Send some dudes up there. Plug that up. Like JJ. And call. Here's Sakata. You can come too. Uh, Keith. You come too. What's the, what's the, what's dividing these guys by color? 
so they don't have like two blacks and two whites on one side and two blues and two yellows. The others you like uh, stay stationed here for when the floaters are coming. Stay here. The other side is Frederick. Maury, you are level 7. You need to get a lot of kills and shit. I mean, they have to come here. They have to... you move here? I mean the grass is 25, okay, but well, this is 10%, whatever that means. So I want to say you have 211 agility? Is that correct? I don't understand why, why, why it says 211 agility for you. And 24 short. I don't know how those numbers are made. What is this 15%? I don't know how that works. Stand back a bit, you're the long range guy. Thing on that side, huh? Oh, can you shoot some from me? Yes, you can. Do it. Oh, uh. He only has short range weapons, so I don't really care. Do whatever you want. want that? Because if that's the case, I would want to like talk to that. I don't know. Okay, but these guys are definitely need to shoot down an arm. They have, do, do they both have the switch skill? Probably. They're usually the same, aren't they? Yeah. What about hover boys? Nothing. But they do have long-range weapons. Yeah, uh, let's stay back a bit more. Let them come in here. 
I don't want them to shoot me from the water. Shoot the guy up there? No, he's too far up. Okay, okay. And await them here. There are two mines here waiting for them. Whoa, he went <laughs> far in here. Just to grab a Keith? Your hover shoes make you look ridiculous, dude. Absolutely ridiculous. I guess I'm moving very far, huh? the bridge with everyone? But okay. I don't care. He can't hover anymore. You're level 12. How about you take him down? Maybe <sighs> we can't move very far. That's a rock, you can't shoot there. Attack this guy. Any way you want. Command. He probably has long range weapons, right? Yeah, one. He has trouble shooting us, too, though. So that goes both ways. Whatever you want. Wherever the rockets just happen to hit. I think the level of gold bonus goes up over time, because that was a lot. The Avenue leg. Move 14. All my legs have a move of 16, I think, so everything with a 14 is something I don't even want to think about. There's still a mine here, so I think we're still safe. So do nothing for now. I can't go anywhere. So yeah, 
We're good. Can you shoot someone? Yes, you can. Oh, that's just that one. Okay, no, the other one's like two, four, six up. Yeah, he's too far away. Is he already leaving? This is what I mean about the enemies. I attacked him once, and now he's out of combat. He's gonna bugger off. Like, tch. okay, that makes this easy for me. Pee what is wrong with you? Move more! Jesus! Hey, the commander. Oh, should I look at one arm? Uh, the left one? It's usually the left one, right? The right one. The right arm has the ranged weapon. That's the one that needs to go. Here's the right arm. Usually it's the left one though. Oh, you can go after him. He's also important to go. Right arm. Enough, are you kidding me? Wow, I just need a plink on the right arm. And you hit the legs three times. Just plink the right arm. You hate his legs. What is he's not even a hoverer? You're not doing anything of worth. He's not allowed to lose his right arm. Because then he can't hit us from the river anymore. That would be horrible. Now if I shoot him, he's gonna like move back again. Come down here and step on the mine. I could aim you, but I would shoot three rockets at an almost dead thing or two. That would that would have been a waste, but it didn't matter anyway. God, that was five people shooting at him. Five. Also, why am I trying to have PB kill him? Mori is level seven. You do it.
No, don't. You will move back. Oh, you can reach him, really. And know, three. Three shots. As many as possible, yeah. Oh, because you're Frederick, you're not JJ. There's the arm gone. He's gonna go back now, of course. So how much did we really gain? He's leaving again now. God, that's annoying. What is wrong with you? They fucking know where the mines are, I'm telling ya! There was no reason why he didn't just step down to fight me. There's no reason at all. He just doesn't do it. Without a grid. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. He is the three. Four, five, six. A Keith. Here. Aim for the body, please. Just don't let him retreat. Yo, the river isn't that bad at all. Oh, stay on the river if you don't have hover legs. Bullshit. Bullshit. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Shoot at this guy, it's so annoying. You can shoot at this guy. Right arm. Good! Eight damage, that'll teach him. He doesn't have the hover legs. Let him retreat. This will be our chance to cross the river. I mean, I'm right here. Might as well kill him. Yeah, I should be fairly safe on the bridge because, like, their ranged guys can't just come in and shoot us, but this is like 50 fucking places up. Ah. 
they can't shoot there. So stay with him just in case something horrible happens. What if I put Gregorio here instead? Will you come down now? I have this theory that maybe he thinks he's standing next to Paul. He's like, oh, I can attack Paul. No, I can't. Ah, uh, then I do nothing. Oh wait, he already moved. He needs some repairs. Same with Keith. Hey, they're not coming. Don't attack him. Paul! Get away from that square. I think it's causing problems. Okay, you four. You might as well use this time that we have. To resupply next turn. It's kind of stupid, but it's true. All I want was someone to step on the mine. Okay. Oh no, I can come down here. <sighs> but the commander might come down. That's even better because I don't want him to go back and repair his weapons. Oh, come on! You luck boy! 25% chance of the body. Oops, you did! None of Keith's parts were hurt, except for that. Now you can come down here. Uh, Keith. Oh, at least that. That's a good thing that happened. So I can't resupply this turn. Because there's enemies in my grill. Key through and everything. He has to go. Good job. My god, my, my dudes. You don't deserve leveling up. I think... Yeah, he was plinked a bit. Which is not very good. Like, our best is just not enough, is it?
a uh, flash grenade on him, please. We can't deal with him this turn. He does have a switch skill, he's too dangerous. health on every part except the body of course that's just ludicrous that is the epitome of bad luck good it'll be a shame if those seven body hp got plinked down Plink those seven body HP down, please! Thank you! Of course, now these guys aren't supplied. I can still... Yeah. I can still, like, flash the guy the second turn, right? I have so many flash grenades. This is why I have them. I mean, you still have ammo, though, right? No. Yeah, exactly. Does supply also heal you to full? No, it doesn't. Alright, everyone's re ammoed. After him, I think it takes high movement range to go up here. And you're closer. Oh, you're level 13. You get your experience. Lloyd, you use another flash grenade. Having a lot of flash grenades is really broken. Let's be honest. Now you can completely stun lock someone. Twelve, thirteen, thirteen, thirteen. It's kinda gonna go up here. It's fine. He's safe to shoot now.
I'm really surprised the, the other guys from the other river don't come towards us. I thought for sure they would. Oh, he woke him up. Okay, so the grin this the flash grenades can also be woken up from. You have a stun punch, can you stun him again? This is a bit risky now, but we still have Natalie in case we need to flash him again. Yes! You stunned him again. Wonderful. That happened a lot, like last time, and well he's still continuing this. That's neat. Can't go up there. So I think if you go here, we can't shoot him. That's not your special. Like, I'm not gonna use your specialty unless we're like in a dire situation, unless we need damage. Like in a situation where Keith died. I didn't notice that right away, but yeah, you just sniped his body down, huh? Get up here. Let's just get the people at full health out. Yeah, not with the guy standing there. Okay, that's a that's a valid point. The three shots. Just take down an arm. I don't need to guide that. The arm is almost dead. Just hit it once, so we're good. I can't switch us anymore. I would like to take out the other arm though. The right one. Frederick can't aim. Right arm. Good. Mori? Plink. You need the levels. Wow. Oh, you were so stunned. Really? Get healed a bit. We can make that happen. Nah. You probably can't get up there. Nah. But this is closer. Alder, you need to get repaired, so you stay back a bit. Mori, keep plinking. Your experience is a bit more important to me than Peewee's. Ah, but if you can't kill him, you're still gonna do it. Wow, you guys are not making this easy on me. 
Hans, you do not need to be here. How's I get prepared? He's not gonna move. I need to block him. Keep blinking, he has two body parts, I still think. I think or, or legs dead. No, he still has both. He still has one! The legs didn't die, it's less experience for you, what the fuck? You probably could have leveled up without that. Yes. Probably. Now I get everyone up here. Mori, you are at full health. How far can you go? Only up to here. Hey, yeah, yeah. Very tight quarters here. don't come to us, we must come to them. How far can this guy even move? He can't even go anywhere, he has to go up and around, so we can like go after that truck pretty easily, huh? Okay. Now you can drive! Now there's a road! He's on the road again? <laughs> Looks like Pee Wee's on a road again? Movement ranges that are adequate again. God damn it, Pee Wee. Ah, we have a pilot that's very damaged. of you move out what Lloyd moves first I feel very vulnerable here, but I know that I'm safe here. Oh, we triggered them at least. Only one though. I mean, this guy also moved, but he moved away. So I'm not sure what he's trying to do. that truck. I hate it. Ah, uh, surprise me. It's your choice which part to hit. He chose the body. I can live with that. do as much damage as Paul and the truck is gone. Dude, there's way more damage than Paul, wow. 
Okay, now the enemy will stop being a stupid idiot again. Why was there a leg in the truck? Why do I not, not see the move stat? Did I see the move stat last time we got a leg? Weird. You're not hurt. Alda. You can't stand next to the truck this turn. Okay, you do it then. Oh, if I can hit you from there, you can hit me from there, so let's go. How much range with the speed? Isn't there a way to see that? I do know that sometimes it's like can see like how many tiles up this is. I think in the aiming window, but I'm not sure. I can't go to an aiming window right now. and bulky and peewee. We can also count, this is like one, two, three up to here, so this is three, four, five. That works, anyway. Phase level 15. Remember when Freddy was like, slow to uh, level up? Damn. Oh, how the tables have turned. The left arm, please. Since they have no truck to retreat to, let's uh, maximize experience. Should we use Frederick first, but he's the high level, so he's. Can... Oh, wait! Frederick can't target. Right. So Frederick, sh uh, right, so Frederick can't weaken. Okay. I see there. For more. Think that. Boy, you're one thing part. And another level. There you can see the ray, but only on the double there. Why can you only see the like the height of the platform on one part, but not the one that I'm actually shooting down? I don't understand. 
but okay. I think they have two. Yeah, they have on both offs. Shoot one down anyway. Right, that was a good choice too. Unless you miss, now it's pulling. You are level 12. Drink him. It's weird how some people still don't have skills. Like, how hard to get is that? Hey, how far can you move? Oh, not very far. Can't even get up the ledge. And you don't have ranged weapons, so... Whatever, nerds! moving. What are they doing? And why is it nothing? What are they waiting for? Maybe those guys are programmed to wait for us to try and cross the river and then like, catch us there? Shots and the arms are almost dead. It's not your job, but hey, experience is more important right now. Not really. I mean, how much does that really do? Good! You did nothing. You accomplished nothing with your life. God damn it, Mori. I had to get all the experience then. I can go after him. Okay. You aim down an arm. It's most important right now. The left one first. Doesn't really matter, just oh, an arm. Well, you're both up here. You won't be able to reach him. Yeah, that won't work. Okay. You're the closest guy. This is full range. Flash grenade. We weren't really ready to tangle with him. But I tried anyway. A bit of a heal, don't you? Oh my god, just like Pee Wee already. It's still not moving. The, some of these enemies are very weird about when they attack and the fact that they just decide not to. Not him. The guy next to you. Okay. 
Okay, Frederick. Since you can't aim, you go first. Hmm. That's kind of plinky, isn't it? That's not what I need. I need an arm down. See, I think the left arm still has more health. And since this is safe, go for the left arm. Wonderful. The right arm is clinkable. Don't aim now. If you can hit the right arm, cool, but it's not that necessary. Cool, and you go for the legs too. Sakata. Grave. Distribute the damage a bit. JJ can punch. I was have to end up 10, really. Ooh. I want all of them. Skill, fight. Oh, is it... Oh, can you only have one skill per, like, weapon type? These are all punch skills. Ah. Uh. No, doesn't Yang have double end first? Gregorio's stun has been very good. But the big downside of the punch is that it's you don't have blinking potential at all. First is also good because guns always go before fists. These are all good! That's the problem that I have. These are all good. Ugh. Gregorio's done a good job with stun. I'll take Gregorio's word. I'm a bit too dangerous. Like, I might trigger all three of them now, by myself. I don't want to be all by myself. Do it. It's fine. No! This guy is in front of you! It's so... Like... Is it weird that I expect the default target to be the... To be the guy standing next to you? Anyway, the... Worst thing that happens is Natalie dies and I have to repair her. Oh no! My money! I have so little money! Like, it doesn't matter. This isn't Fire Emblem. I think Pee Wee's timing is done here. Yui. Absolutely. Leave the road again, that's just horrible. Yep, shoot, goes before punch. So, 
Why do you say I may trigger them? I'm clearly in their shooting range. They don't have to come to me. It would be weird if they didn't shoot me. Mori! This is your dude. Oh, now you automatically went to him first, when you could have shot the long range guy. Is there a logic to this that I just don't know? Because I don't see it. Oh, yeah, more. You need to, like, level up your. Like, your what is your short range skill? Is it, like, like, really low? 30, I mean, 300 isn't low, is it? Sakata has more. He has 2000. Okay, but, like, 1300 is not bad. Use the gnote? You all I've ammo already. Man! No one ammo is no problem. At all. What I can go here? Because this tile is 25% that you can't afford that or something. Fine, punch this man then. Argento HD44 Fight 38. Is that a weapon? A jolly flow is it's a, it's an arm then, right? Oh wait, no! It has fight short round, this is an armor, isn't it? No, this, this is a computer! Looks like one wanna have though. You can't show me a name and expect me to know what that is. I need more information than that. Done. Already paying off. Yeah, I know. Gregorio was right. Gregorio, you wonderfully barbarian of a man. You know what you're doing. JJ can learn from you. And he did. That was the point I was trying to make. I can still help you guys. No, Pewee, you really can't. Pewee. Oh, Pewee. I did it again. Can't help myself. Oh, that's Sakata. I thought it was Hans. Whoops. Yeah, it's just have someone stand next to each one of these, because then they will go to close match combat. They are... They just work that way. They don't like using range. If someone's next to them, which I appreciate. You're Frederick. You're level 15. You're good. Miss. Level up. You have 2600 short, that's a lot. Help, guys, he's coming after me. Oh, Pee Wee. It doesn't matter, he doesn't have arms. Then I can shoot him. Yes, it's a good thing, Pee Wee. Woohoo! That's better. That's more than one. It's already paying off somehow. However that's calculated, it's it's already growing. It was still level 12. 
Oh, we have a bunch of third team stuff. Can you take out his legs? Let's just maximize this. Frederick can't aim. Paul. Any one of his arms. Oh, we only have a good note? Hmm. Out of ammo. And you don't hit. Cool. Yeah, you're, you're high level. You're good. Pee Wee is in helping range. He won't do much damage. It's because it's, but that's why he has to level this up, you know. I, I'm pretty sure just fighting gives you more more experience than uh, actually leveling up though. Cicada is level 13. I hit one of the arms, not the body. The body's almost dead. No, you hate his experience. You wanted him dead. Why share experience with others, right? Gregorio. You woke him up. Oh no, now he can look at us. Oh. Okay, so we can't. Just to choose. Yeah. I guess first has a chance, otherwise, I wouldn't have a level. Yeah, double level too. As soon as the JJ is, is on Gregorio's level, Gregorio says, No! I need to be high level! I need to be better than that guy! Where's he trying to go? He's leaving. Three damage shot. Oh, I was less again. Are the next higher defense something? Uh, does he have parts left? No. You do it anyway. If you kill him, that should be level 14 for you. Okay, well, we're done. Now's the Pee Wee and Mori show. He stopped moving, he gave up. He could have kept it, I mean, he just wanted to be there. That was the place he wanted to be in. I think enemies who can't fight us, like, are still moving in a way as if they could fight us. So he just wanted to stand here to attack Pee Wee, probably. He just can't attack. I think that's how the AI works. If they don't have a truck, at least. Level 8 or 9? It's 10! Oh, wow. You're getting somewhere. Slowly, but surely. 
And I might call you Shuri, it's not any worse than Mori, really. Very similar names. Yes, I may have mistaken you for a man. You can't blame me for that. Hexafire could probably do enough damage to kill him, but uh, let's pump out the weapon experience, I guess. Hmm, maybe those twos and threes you, you did were like critical hits? Is that a thing? Show you how it's done. That was a four in there. Very impressive. And it's of course the weapon experience is not determined by like the fact that you fight, but probably by how much damage you do. We can look at that, right? You now have eleven fifty-eight. What happens if I do this? Three hits, seven damage for 11.58. That was five. So it's neither three nor seven. That's the average, but I don't think that's the thing. That would be weird. 15.10. We might not know. There it is. Six and three hits. Fifteen, ten. You got nine. Which is six plus three. Pewie gets the average. Mori gets the sum. Let's just assume that is the truth and not think about this anymore. Not because I don't understand it. And I'm too tired. And I don't really feel like figuring it out. But because I just assume this is what it is now. Let's just assume it's nonsense. Number goes up, that's all that matters. So did you get experience for that, though? You had 63. Yes, you did. You just get 4. You just get 5. I guess you just get a raw number. Uh, I guess this is a balancing part. Like, each character has a growth rate for their skills. So, like, a guy like... JJ wouldn't get much experience for long-range weapons, but he would get more for punching. Let's just assume that's how it is. Also, why is this taking so long? Jesus Christ. He's been dead for several turns now, but he's still alive despite being dead. There, you did it. But he didn't level up. No enemies in sight. The situation is under control. The regular army has arrived. The neighboring cities are as good as ours now. Is one of the neighboring cities a city we can buy new parts in? 10,000. Man, those big ones were worth 400. Damn, we got like almost 20,000 then. Oh no, my money. Yeah, peseta. This is peseta. Sure, well first call is the first save. Can I grind if necessary? It won't be necessary. There's not, nothing here, okay. No events happening. Wonderful. What do you have for me, good sir? Weapons wise. Four times nine. Three times thirteen. I'm actually considering doing the five times five over the four times eight. Because it's a plinking gun, and the more plinks you do, like, that's its purpose, isn't it? I'm considering that. 1 times 36. A 
Flame Fox, one times 43. Whoa! Neat. It's like a flamethrower, but it's not a different damage type, so who cares? Hand draw. I think we have the hand draw 37. That's a new bazooka. Hit 60. I need to know if that's better, like, accuracy wise. Slab. No, it's wrong. It's the same accuracy. Yeah, so it's not a huge deal then. Ooh, the Pete's 8. 3 times 22. Neat. And we have the gold here. Speaking of giving away. I want a Pete's 8 though. I love the Pete's 8. The upgrade. Ah, it's ways. It has more weight though. It has more engine too. That would be the default thing. 212, 48. I mean, the 8 is now. We don't need to count that. Ooh, this one has more weight and less engine. That just won't do at all. This is just engine. Nah. Zicade is the answer. Do you have an accuracy arm for this one? Yes, the Zicade arm. And for the right arm, we would get... Vasa probably. It has no more defense, but that might be okay. He has just more health, which is good. Vasa Punch, 33. What? Oh, that's a can. I was gonna say, wait, a punch that's 5 times 7? You're 5 times 7 though. But then you can't mount anything on the shoulder. Like, and that's like where the... No. That's where the shield would go. Do you have any extra movement range legs? Oh, we can probably upgrade one like this. this is Zacade. This one is the exact same one we have, it just weighs more. It's so worthless. Yeah. What in fossil is Zacade? Zacade legs. Computer. That's a general upgrade. Fighting. Punch one, short and long range. This is even better pu punching. This is even better short long range. Yeah! Good computers. Backpack! Another item. Plus one range? What does plus one range mean in this case? Would a backpack increase like your shoulder mount guns by a range? We'll have to find out next time. On front mission. Until then.